Okay, in this question, we are talking about palindromic regions, palindromic sequence, and uh, they are asking, they are giving us a sequence, and that sequence, instead of giving the entire palindromic region, they are giving us uh, half of the palindromic uh, restrictions site, and they are asking you to complete the sequence. So here, for example, they give you half and they asking you okay what do you think that it will be this part same thing here they are giving you this section and they are asking you okay what about if you do what are do you think that are the nucleotide that they should be here and here they are asking you to do this one and as we have the chargaff rules and we know what is a palindromic region or a palindromic sequence we can solve this question very easy so let's just all, let's start going with the first one Okay, to answer this question, you need to remember that a palindromic uh, region has uh, four main components. So here you have one here on the top in the left that is the same to the one in the bottom in the right. Yeah, here you have two T's and here you have two T's in the two extreme. And in the center, here you have A and C and here you have C and A, yeah. So they 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 are the same sequence but running in opposite in the inverse uh, direction. And here you have this one and this one, and they are the same. Again, and in the extreme you have two A's. And if you see in the center, you will have here a T and G, and here you will have exactly the same, but in the opposite order. Okay, it will be G and T. Okay, so that is very important. Those regions are the same, but they run in opposite directions. Because they, uh, the DNA is anti-parallel, if you remember. And they are, they are asking you in this question, if we give you this, could you add the other sections? And they said, definitely, because if you remember, this green box is going to be the same that here, but running in the opposite direction. And you can also add, find the pink region. Why? Because there is complementary. And if you know the Chargaff rules that A is complementary to T and C is complementary to G, there is no problem. So let's try to solve it together. So here you have, they gave you this region. Now we are going to try to find this region. Yeah. So let's do it together. So we have this region here. I color code it. Uh, the G is in yellow, C is in blue, and A there in without any color. So now you can please try to find the complementary of those ones, the one that run from three prime to five prime. Okay, I am. I guess that you already did it, so maybe you already found that the complementary stand will be C, G, T, and C. Okay. And now, the next step, you have we have this one. Now we have this one. And if you remember, if you have this one, you have the other section of the blue. But remember, they run in opposite direction. So this one too will be in the extreme. And here you have C A. So here you have A and C. Yeah. So these go in the opposite direction. So the next step, what we have to do is. So we have here C in the extreme. Here now you will have C. Uh, and here the next one will be T. The next one will be G. And the next one will be C. Okay, so it was pretty easy. Let's go and try to do the next one. In this question, we have the five prime section, but now we miss the section, the sequence that is close to the three prime. So again, as we have four sections, we have this one, and now we don't have this one or this one or this one, but we can easily find them. So remember, with this one, we're going to find the other different regions. So 
How we do that? We start finding the complementary. Pretty easy. So please find the complementary of this section. And the complementary will be A is complementary to T. A, T is complementary to A. G is complementary to C. And C is complementary to G. So pretty easy. Now the next step is uh, so we they gave us this one we have the complementary and now with this one again we are going to find this section and remember this one is goes in the opposite direction yeah so t and g this one will be g and t so you have this missing section from here and now we put it on the top so the c will be the first one then the g will be the second one that is here the t will be the third one and the a will be the fourth one so uh, as a result this sequence will be this one so you will have definitely t a c and g and the other section will be a c g t and a okay so pretty easy and now let's solve the the last question the question and the question number c okay so the here again they gave us the section close to the five prime but now we need to find the section of close to the three prime in our words again we have this one but we don't know these other regions but we can easily find it because there is complementary uh, between the bases and this is a palindromic region so four regions these four regions will be very similar so in other words with this one we will be able to find not only the green one but the pink ones again so let's do it again to start solving this one the complementary and here is the sequence so please find the complementary and so the complementary to a will be t the complementary to c will be g the complementary to a will be t the complementary for 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 c will be g and the complement for g will be c so pretty easy now again we have we start with this one we got this one now we are going to find the other one and remember they run in opposite direction so extremes here and here t and g yeah go in this direction and here uh, the it will be the opposite direction g and t okay so we're going to add the missing section so now that we start with the if you want you can start with the extreme we have to put it uh, to flip this section so t will be in the extreme so t is here then it will be g g will be here t will be here uh -huh. g will be here so you can see it here and c is here okay so now the sequence will be of course a c a c and g and remember the other section will be c g t g and t okay okay so it will be this this is the thing okay i hope that that was clear if you have any doubt please let me know have a good day and bye